we got to just talk about him and we will be talking about him because that's just the kind of performance has been uh, and he of course without doubt is our omni gel spray performer of the day no pain for mumbai fans there was pain for him as lisa is saying uh, but in the end there was just a lot of pain for the bowlers because he got a century and he got out of the striker of 200 yeah he might be using the omni gel a little bit later just to <laughs> ease the pain but um, yeah he was sensational i mean the moral of the story is if he had stuck around in the last game against kkr i mean he got himself to 50 yeah. and then he hit that full toss straight up in the air normally that just goes into the third tier of andre russell if he had stuck around they would have won that game as well i mean he's polished when it comes to finishing understanding the game knowing when to what's required Uh, he's sensational. I mean, this is definitely his best format by far. Uh, I just hope it's not a proper injury that might jeopardise what he has to do later on next month uh, yeah. with regards to the the Cricket World Cup. But he was he was really good, and I think once he's at the crease and once he gets a decent score, invariably it takes all the pressure off of Mumbai and their chase. I just want to bring to your attention as as a fan, what you see from outside. Yes, of course, you see just delicious lip smacking. shots all around the ground mm. but that body language that facial expression when you're looking at him you keep thinking and we've seen that meme 100 times right when he did this and he goes yeah when many years ago mm. it's just you feel that that comes out from the screen when you're watching it when he's on days like this well and especially when they had lost 3 wickets for 31 runs right mm. and it's only a couple of days ago that they struggled to chase a very similar total. So we we were sitting there going, "Oh, here we go again. They're looking a little bit worried." But to be able to come out, have that presence, yeah. like you said, um and display that against the opposition bowler. So the best way sometimes if you're under fire is attack. Mm. And that's what he does well. And he's able to kind of minimize the noise that's going on and go into his little bubble and go, "No, it's me versus bowler. I've got this." Yeah. You know, and that's why he's one of has been one of the best T20 players for a long period of time. That's also the nature of his technique and the nature of his scoring areas is that it doesn't look like it's any stress. Yeah. You know, you kind of just use the pace or you kind of give yourself a little bit of room, use the pace, caress it over cover. And I think because of the areas he can score in You know some batters get to the crease and you think well if that delivery comes they'll put it away. Well he's got many more options than most, you know. He yeah. he can and it all looks sort of pain free stress free when he um when he gets into position. I think that's what makes him so easy on the eye and that's why you think well how are you going to get him out? Like well yeah. how's he going to how's he going to mess this up because it just seems to come easy. Yeah, you know, there's some players who just look and you think oh, he's got more time than the others. Mm. He's one of those. This guy and And it's such a good point that you say that. How is he going to mess it up? It seems like he, when he's in, in form like this, mm. it seems the only way he's going to get out is if he messes it up. Mm. It doesn't seem like the bowler ever has any wood over him. No, it, th- there's no ripper of a delivery. You know, swung in, hit the seam, and decked away. It's T20 cricket as well. That's why he performs really well at this level because the movement isn't necessarily there that you see in potentially other formats, but. like Polly said his technique's really good he he um we were looking at his feet positioning and how he can open up you know through the offside and then there's just this slight shuffle and literally he's able to go 180 degrees the other way oh, the other way around so, um, <laughs> you're a bit like surya you're breaking things in the stadium yeah. so um it, it's quite amazing how he's able to do that and that's just a little shuffle of maybe an inch or so with his guard. Mm. Mm. He also he plays with the opposition as well. Yeah, particularly yeah. the spinners. I mean he played with Janssen today so he hits him in that area and then scoops him. But those two sweep shots back to back. I think that's the prime example of his yeah, strength and his ability. Yeah. He waits for the one that's too straight and then he gets it nice and fine and you can almost see the captain go, "Okay, just move a little bit fine and <laughs> I've got you now." And then he waits for the next one that's in front of square. Yeah. And to be able to have the precision and placement that he does, um that puts teams under pressure. It puts captains under pressure because yeah. he knows how to get the ball into certain areas. It's not a case of if you miss I just hit you out the ground. even his fours and the balls he chips into different areas he's very good at doing and some of the no look shots where he just hit it nobody ran because you knew that it was going to be a four and the last point i think out of the 51 deliveries he played the only 
four deliveries perhaps that you would say Hyderabad had the edge over him was that I think that wicket maiden that your your boy your neighbor Pat Cummins bowled to him that was like proper test cricket morning of uh, first day morning <laughs> it was like all outside off swiping and missing yeah he um he just honed in on that line and length didn't he he goes I don't need to change it you know slightly went away 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 and then the last ball just kind of nipped it back in but then as we know, these white balls don't uh, hold too much swing or or seam long. position for too long and all of a sudden it, it played into Sky's hands. Mm. So he did well to miss it, so, he, yeah. so he's in form there. It <laughs> is, it is, because uh, other days you edge those and uh, you're caught behind. But what a fantastic 100 by Surya Kumar Yadav. In a winning cause, he'll be super happy, he has carried his team to two points. And that's what you expect from your retained players, from your senior players, from your gun players. You expect them uh, to win you a few games. All right, so that was Surya Kumar Yadav, our Omni Gel Spray performer of the day. He ensured there was no pain for fans, getting uh, 102 not out in 51 balls, 12 fours and 6 sixes.